Welcome to ICT channel. So today I will show you about uh, the tools in Wix.com. So as you know, Wix.com is one of the best software to create website in the mini. So I will show you about the tools that we can use in the Wix. So. I already joined with it with my Google account, so I just want to show you how to uh, create new site and then uh, how we uh, use tools in every uh, page and then every display in that page. So I just uh, the new, get new site and then let's say portfolio and choose a template. So let's say I can play. A So my template is one, just edit. If you want to edit or you want to view it yeah, first, so you can just click here. So now we just, we just edit. So this document is allowing you to create a new website. And then it's then let's provide us with so many templates. So we just use uh the template that we think it's uh good for us so just wait so while waiting uh in the term it will be show the something like it's the gif something like this let's say uh they still create the template So here we go. So here it's so many tools. I will uh, explain one by one what's the function and then uh, you will need to use that one. First, you see this one. It will be page about me. So what's that mean? If you see this one in here, you see this is the page. So let's say this is for page. And then the first page, it will be you know, uh, show us our first page in the website. Let's say we want to move the resume. So I won't go to the resume, just click the resume. Right, and then it will be go to the resume page. So basically it's about if you want to control uh, or going to next pages. So you just need to change from here. Okay, and then one says this is the icon. Uh, since uh, Wix.com is not allowing only one uh, version, it's allowed to two version in desktop and then set, switch to mobile. And then this is the site, the save, how you save, how you duplicate site, transfer site, this preview, it's here. And then this is setting to get domain, mobile friendly accessibility, I think. Yep, and then tools, toolbar, layer. This is like example like this. If you want to see the rulers, yeah, this is the rulers. And then the grid line, it will be help you get so nice function because you will see like the line for our content. And then the dev mode, this is uh, dev mode is a technical preview, no need for now. And then the help the editor for hub center if you want as some things that makes the videos in here and then this update button if you want to update your your wix.com account and this is undo redo save if you and publish okay so i will just try to save this one first so when when you save this one it will be show you so better in the wixsite.com this is your website name so better if you want like create a, your own website let's say your your own portfolio website better you use your name you create your, your new account email and then it will be your gmail or your email name and then after that dot website.com so the, uh, just make sure to make it nice just use this one like me i use ict mentari as a gmail account and then, then it will appear ict mentari dot 
twixtra.com slash my side three. You only can change this one. Okay, just post this one. And then now we move to the left tools in here. What is that? So first the pages. The pages. Here we go. So the pages you can like you can copy, duplicate, and delete. So it's up to you, right? Simple. Uh, I don't want this. So it's almost same like this one. So if you want to go to next pages, just click this one. So the pages are uh, that's uh, let's say in the here I don't want to use this one. Press soon, just delete. Okay, simple. I just delete this one. And then if you want to add some page, like add, just click that page in here. Look, it will be a new page and just rename directly. So that's how you control your pages. So next, uh, we will see the main. Just change to this one. About me. Okay, this is the background. If you want to change the background, like a sample color image video can be image can be video, or can be uh, the background from the Wix.com. So I just use so, and choose one of these. Let's say we will use this one. Okay, just click this one and then even you can like add image, just like image in here if you want to and then if you want to apply other page that's you can use apply to other page media from with or let's say upload media if you want to get your own image as a background just Okay. Next, let's just post this one. Okay, let's see. Up, apply to other page if you want all of the pages like about me, project, and contact with the same uh, background. Let's say apply other, to other page about me, project, and then yeah. and then just post this one. Look, you will see. Right, this is the background. Okay, and then so after that, uh, so uh, if you want to add, we go. You can add to the background. You want, let's say, I want to add the text, image, anything. Let's say the image, my uh, previous image. Okay, from here, previous image. Yes, let's say a uh, logo. Let's say there is. Not logo. Let's say this one. I just have this. Add to page. Let's click add to page. Then this is. And then you can move anywhere you want. This one. Okay. You can do this. Right. Undo the top setting this uh, settings in here, and then let's say filter animation link top design setting can look, you can change here. Okay, and then and the on the right side is your the uh, like simple simple tools that you can use like a copy paste erase, and then this is the alignment. So we can use this one. Example, it's going to the bottom. We just take a line to left. Okay. And then the size also here. Size PS position. If you want to change the position, like X and Y, horizontal vertical. If they want, if you doesn't want to add this one, let's say I just delete, click delete, work. And then add apps also will be allow you to add some app from the market like like a uh, widget something like that okay you can like instagram social uh, sign or like you can make for you this one in the standing now in police and on demand so anything you can add 
can be like that. This one is like extension. Okay, so next also the media. This is your media. Okay, so for the studio, edit image and video, like edit image, which is your media. Yes, you can just and then start blogging. This is if you want to start blogging, you know, right? The blogging is like allow you like uh, just make a many of chat from the other the other uh, people to show in your website. So you can use this one app now. Okay. And then I think yeah, that's it for now to introduce about the tools in Wix.com. So I hope you can uh, know about this well and then if you have a question just comment in google classroom in our google classroom if you have a question just comment in google classroom and then you if you have like a uh, once i create like many of tutorial and then just describe in the google classroom what tutorial that you want to i uh, show it to you okay uh, thanks for now thank you everyone and see you again Bye-bye.